it's Jasmine again. I'm gonna be doing this um quick and easy total updo, but this time with a uh, front roll. I today I used um these volume rods. They're kind of vintage. Um, it's a long story, but um, basically my where I used to live, my old neighbors gave my mom like these like hot stick roller things because they didn't want them, and my mom took them. And sorry, I was fixing the camera. <laughs> and um, basically, they just gave them to her, and I've been using them a lot recently. I've never used them a lot, but they work really well when I do this portal up to. So yeah, this is how they look. I'm gonna be using these today. They're from like the 90s, I believe, because I have the packaging, so they're like from the 90s, but I just like basically set it, you know, because I didn't sleep with the rollers on tonight, but I just set my hair. I'm going to be setting my hair with these, and if you want to keep watching, stay tuned. Oh, and also guys, I wanted to mention this hair flower. It's by this lovely lady, her boutique, hold on, let me, her, the name of her Etsy shop is Ms. Bree Boutique. I will go ahead and link her Etsy store on in the description box, but uh, she sent this lovely flower to me. It's two beautiful orchids, so thank you so much for that. So please go check out her shop. So, like I said, guys, if you want to keep watching and see how i did this hairstyle please keep watching okay guys so if you watch my poodle updo tutorial with bumper bangs before um you would know that i'm just going to tie my hair up the same way i did in that video with a very high ponytail and i'm just gonna start sectioning off my bangs because that's going to be my front roll. So I'm just smoothing my hair out and just doing a, a very high ponytail. And I'm going to be using some heat protectant spray since these are hot, like hot rollers. I still kind of want to protect my hair, you know, just in case my hair gets a little damaged. I'm also going to be using the Suavecita grooming spray. To help set my curls while I when I put the hot rollers on, and it, this is how they look. And another alternative, guys, this is like the same thing as like hot rollers. You know, you can buy them like at the store or like Amazon stuff like that. So I forgot to mention that earlier in my video that you can also use hot rollers for this it's like the same thing these are just called volume rods because i guess they give you volume but i'm just using them like like this you know and i just i didn't do any particular sections in my hair i just did like three sections on my bangs i usually do four sections but i just did three sections and they come with like these little stick things I guess to hold on to the roller and also they they like when you turn it on you have to wait for them to heat up so that's what I did oh, and I forgot to mention that's why I'm not wearing makeup right now because I like to put the rollers on before I put my makeup on so that way my hair can start setting while I do my makeup
and I'm just going to roll the rollers downward. throughout all my head and the rollers are supposed to turn um, pink again once they have cooled down they turn white when they're hot but they turn pink once they're once they have cooled down so I guess that's cool Okay, so I did my makeup ready and my hair is set, my curls are set, and now I'm just going to be taking out all of the rollers or hot sticks, whatever. They're more like sticks now that I think about it because they're really thin. But as you can see, it gave me like somewhat of a tight curl. Okay, so I took all of the rollers out. I'm also very sorry guys about the lighting. I had I had gone to the living room because my room is just really hot right now. That's another thing I don't like about, you know, making videos in my room in the summer because it's just extremely hot. So I went to my room, my room, I'm sorry. I went to the living room because it's a lot fresher over there and then the AC is right there. But the lighting was kind of bad so I'm sorry about that so I just kind of zoomed in the video so so you guys can see a little better I'm just basically forming like little ringlets like my other um, poodle hair tutorial um, you can make them messy but I usually like to make them like I like to do each curl separately or sometimes I separate the hair and make more curls but I had just put some pomade all over my hair first to smooth out my hair but now but now I'm just teasing my bangs in two sections with my comb and then I'm gonna spray some of my suavecita hairspray and now I'm putting some pomade to smooth out my bangs and the flyaways So now I'm just doing a front roll in my hair and I'm gonna pin it with like two or three bobby pins. That hair was sticking out a lot but I'm gonna fix it when I'm done.
again i'm really sorry about the lighting guys i tried to see if i can make the video any brighter but my video editor doesn't have that option but i hope you can see what i'm doing i know it kind of got cut off in the camera it's just my tripod is so small and i try to fit my whole head <laughs> in the video but i'm sure you get the idea i'm just like making like little ringlets with the curls and then just pinning them pinning them down and for the back I just did the same thing I just kind of felt my head and tried to put the curls in a good position to cover my um my hair tie you know because you don't want that to show I'm sorry I didn't show it on camera but it, I'm just doing the same thing I'm doing in the front Now I'm smoothing my hair out and the flyaways and I'm going to put some palm meat on. And then I'm going to spritz it with some hairspray to hold it in place. And I ended up just fixing it off camera and putting the hair flower on off camera as well. So this is the finished look. This is how my hair turned out. I really um, hope you guys enjoyed this hair tutorial and I hope you guys try it. If you guys try out any of my hairstyles, I always forget to mention that. Please tag me or you know send DM me the photos on my Instagram. I always um, put my Instagram username on the description box if you want to follow me on Instagram. But yeah guys, thank you so much for watching.